Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons. And the first question is, which of the following is a start codon? I recommend you, highly recommend you to learn from the codon table just four codons. One would be start codon and three would be stop codons. You don't have to memorize the whole table. Uh, nobody needs it. Uh, you always can open a table and uh, find out any codon and its sequence and which amino acid it specifies but uh, you need to know uh, one start codon and three stop codons for uh, your uh, exam so here is a codon table and as you see uh, here we have three stop codons that doesn't specify any amino acids and we have one start codon that also specify uh, amino acid mesianine so AUG specifies um, start codon and this is answer C and second question synthesis of new strand of DNA always occurs in which direction imagine that this is replication bubble so here we have double stranded DNA two strands separated and new strands are built. So somewhere here and here uh, our replication uh, bubble started to separate and for example if we would have 5 prime end here so here we would have 3 prime end and 3 prime end here and 5 prime end here and uh, replication would uh, start with addition of um, RNA primers so imagine that somewhere here we would have RNA primer on this strand and somewhere here on this strand of the um, new DNA that would be synthesized so if we have 3 prime end here in this primer we would have 5 prime end here and 3 prime end here and replication always goes in one direction from 5 prime end to 3 prime end so in this direction new strand of the DNA would grow continuously so what would happen to this part uh, of the DNA because as far as you know uh, replication would happen in both directions so more primers RNA primers would be added here and primers also would have 5 prime end and 3 prime end so 5 prime end and 3 prime end here and once again new strand of the DNA would be synthesized in from 5 to 3 prime direction so would go in this direction and in this direction so the same direction as here but here it happens continuously and here it is would be um, organized in Okazaki fragments so on the overall growth would be in this direction but as you see uh, it's going to be backwards and the same picture we are going to see on the other strand of the DNA so if we have 5 prime end here uh, on this um, primer we would have 3 prime end here and 5 prime end here so from uh, 5 prime end to 3 prime end direction our new strand of the DNA would grow continuously so 3 prime end here and here we would have the same picture as on the other strand of the DNA where growth uh, also would be from 5 prime end to 3 prime end so would grow in this direction uh, the same direction but uh, on the overall uh, our new strand would grow in this direction so no matter that uh, when uh, replication bubble as you see would grow 
in two directions. Uh, growth actually happens only in one direction from 5 prime end to 3 prime end. So the correct answer would be answer B. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. Please write your comments, questions if you have any. And see you in the next video. Goodbye.